So uh, Matt decided to fly in a day earlier so we could surprise Hidaya because Matt is Hidaya's favorite. We kind of have to give her what she wants. Closet. How am I going to get her in her closet? Because when she so comes home, she kind of... like, you guys are going to wear matching outfits for Saturdays. Ooh, okay. Hello, how are you doing? Hello. We were all thinking about matching colors on Saturday, so... What are you thinking? Yeah, oh, you're, uh, oh, you're asking me first? We were thinking about either doing like something green. Can you, can you tell me? <laughs> <laughs> Struggling oh, trying to come on with it. Like, yeah, like, I was sitting there just like Zane. <laughs> <laughs> I hate you so much. Oh, I always gotta cry. Yes. Can't hope my sister cries every time. <laughs> so yeah, he was in there. I was telling him, Matt, don't steal anything from their place. So fuck them. You come out with bangles. It's like <laughs> and I, uh, so. Oh. This is the first boy in her room. <laughs> All of these your hijabs? No, I had another sister and my mom. Oh, we all oh hold on. All of well, I mean, you, can, you can use whatever you want, though. Oh, yeah. how color coordinated. Oh, yeah. Is. It's like silk and then black. MTV Cribs, but instead of like, just a shoe collection, it's just like. It's, it's, <laughs> I thought for a second, though, that you like knew I was there. She like hops on the bed. She's like, hi, hops on the bed. And she almost grabs the camera. I thought she noticed that it was recording. I'm surprised how quick I got you to that closet. You asked. Why would I not? I just, that could have been in there for a long time. <laughs> just, she heard, like, ooh, matching outfits. Like, <laughs> I got some. Ideas. But I thought Hedaya was gonna go to her hijab. She's like, um, so I don't know. Everything's here. I don't need to go in my closet. Okay, well, salam alaikum. We're here. Salam alaikum. Assalam. I thought Heath was coming. No, we were. That was a ploy. Just to keep your hijab on in case you just walked in and just, all right. Imagine I just have to blur her like. We forget that you can't see it, so we're just like, Matt, Matt, wait. Yeah, I just surprised her like this. Indian mukbang. An Indian mukbang. The chicken it's not gonna look crazy because we're not gonna have a bunch of food. We should. We should. I told we, you. we just put a bunch of frozen food all like, in the front. Oh, no, no. I just I forgot a movie. So mukbang, you're eating a bunch of different things. I, in my head, I wasn't thinking. I just thought we'd all eat butter chicken. I don't know. I already made butter chicken. I'm in Florida at my dad and my stepmom's house. Her daughter also lives. Hidaya, my half sister. And Matt came a couple days early for the Fort Lauderdale show to hang out and just have fun. I told Matt to make sure to look up some articles to see. <laughs> well, <laughs> you didn't make sure. I. Sure. What was it? What was the article? Was uh, it? Ten things to know before going to a Muslim. Oh my God! And I learned a lot. I did. It was just funny because I just said I'm sweating up a storm right now. Oh, oh my God! <laughs> Me and <laughs> Jerry. <laughs> I'm not, I can't even like <laughs> I'm gonna film it for you guys. You guys could smell this right now. You guys don't understand. It looks so gross. Look at that. Oh, like, it looks so bad. This is the butter chicken. Oh, that's it. Wow. This is stuff. the bread we eat. There she is over there. Pop it in the parhatas on the electronic stove. I'm and tech Muslim. <laughs> She's exactly. like putting on Snapchat. <laughs> I wasn't allowed to post that I was even in Florida yet. <laughs> oh, yeah. I was so scared. I was like, well, I find everything. She finds out that I'm like, I'm home when I don't even post. It's weird because I'm not in everybody's Snapchat. So she's oh, just like, where's Zane? Zane? And I have nothing better to do. I've got like, headphones, I'm watching everyone's Snapchat. Where is he? Yeah. Where is he? So, so what is this bread? Literally dough. It's buttery, flaky, like like how puff pastry is. But more like not as it won't break if you like And that's your bread. The die is correct on that, right? Yes. I'm just want to make how exactly do you make butter chicken? So we can tell you. From a packet. <laughs> I thought you make it by hand. Cut the chicken by hand. I cut the chicken yesterday. Don't even. I, I feel deceived right now. It was a team effort. I a team effort by a packet. Wait, now do I only use my right hand? <laughs> <laughs> Number one, I just want to point it out, they're real people. But I think the most important thing you should always know, oh. we're more like than we are different. And as much as we want to like focus on differences, it's all about having these types of moments exactly. connecting, bringing friends together. Don't focus on the differences. Yeah. We love a woke king. Oh, poetic. The second one, know the difference between haram and haram. <laughs> That's just like Dane, this is this is haram. haram this, is or haram. this better be halal. This, this is not is, this is this is halal. There is no halal. So you know what the process of halal is? From what I understand, haram <laughs> is like, things that are pork based or like not necessarily. Al, not necessarily. al meat and like chicken can also be considered halal if it's not cut in the way where the blood is dripping down. Okay. It goes down <laughs> and it's, it's like the kosher. It's like kosher. It is really the same chicken, but it's the way it's cut. Yeah, it all tastes yeah. the same. Chicken tastes like chicken anyway. How would you know? That? I assume it. That's <laughs> 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 Another thing I learned in the article is to eat with your right hand. Hold on. I don't <laughs> so know. Know. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, but you turn the 
Right no, but I'm a right. He only so eats with right hand. Eat Lefties have to eat with their right hand. That's not fair. They, they eat with their left. It's right because hand. you're supposed to be using your left hand for all bathroom activities. Hey. Oh, that is. <laughs> <laughs> I do not eat my own bathroom. Yeah. Uh, Guys, are you just eating bread? Well, it's so hot, and, and the no, chicken was so hot. We got to dip it in bread. Oh, I'm so upset. Well, I'm wasting food. Matt, how are you? What are you doing, Matt? What are you doing? Eat burritos. You can't eat it like that. Oh wait. <laughs> Hello. Watch her die. How she eats. Yeah. Look, you gotta swoop. Okay. Because it's just gonna get soggy. Hadai, you gotta like down. He's got about 15 years of eating. Food. Okay. No alcohol, right? I just want to make this clear. This is not wine. <laughs> we didn't. We didn't like bless the meal. Oh no. Usually you say bismillah. Bismillah. Which I do every single time. <laughs> I knew we were forgetting something. So when you greet it, my stepmom and Hedaya cannot touch them, can't look at them, and not talk to them. <laughs> I made sure of that because like it was the first time I met you. Oh, you like, want Hedaya? And you went, no, no, no. I'm like, well, nice to you. And you're like, no, no, no. I was really sad to it was see because so like, Hedaya. I wanted Hedaya. to hug everyone. It was just like, all oh, his friends are guys. And I'm like, oh. Even when David left, he's like, I really want to hug you. Like, I really want to hug you. Like, yeah. <laughs> well, it's a funny story. When we were in Orlando, we went to Universal Studios after. Oh, like, yeah. Say after Playlist Live. And we got there, and there were a lot of. How would you describe the groups of girls? Mahjibas. Mahjibas. <laughs> Muslim girls in like a church group. Muslim so school. Muslim, like, a mom. Muslim, so they had all their students. All the hundreds. There were hundreds in the park. No, and and just girls. It was both girls and guys, but I felt like there were so many girls. Because you can't tell the guys are Muslim or not. They all fully clothed, scarf, and it just like a dot. It was nuts. And it was the day after you left. You were gone home, and I wish you were there. Everybody was They were going nuts for, for saying. But what was really funny is the groups of girls all had like their teachers with them. These older women yeah. that were like supervising them. <laughs> <And> we <laughs> all saw Zane. They were just like <laughs> all of them. <laughs> Taking group shots. All the girls are trying to put their arms around Zane, and they're like, "No, no!" It, it was the funniest thing because they like hit me. I was like, "Oh my god, they really like can't be doing that to me." Because after experiencing the diet and how they were touching you, I was also like, oh, no, no, "No, these girls are crossing the line." Right security, now. don't touch him. Even if the girls are standing in front of me, like kind of in front of me to take a picture, they, they were not allowed. They had to like either be behind me Pictures or like. Pictures are so awkward. When I see my cousin, they're just like, "Come on, it's your cousin." I'm just like, <laughs> "Happy." <laughs> it's like, it's good. You never get sick. This is delicious. Right. Right? It's like okay, you make this in LA. Send him the recipe. It's a packet that <laughs> I learned today. Send us packets of these. I'll bring that with me. You've been in summer school right now, studying hard. It's just so easy for you. You don't even need to study. What's study? I feel like you had a little bit of a tough time earlier in the freshman and sophomore. You're going to be making great grades lately, right? No, oh, yeah, my grades you better are better. Be. Zane, what, what did you graduate with? I graduated with an associate point. degree in arts. <laughs> I guess what I'm doing for a degree in the arts. That was hospitality. That's a famous birthday. No, it was a liberal. I used to go to school for criminal justice. Imagine me being a cop. <laughs> well, my favorite thing about Muslim culture is the greeting too. Salam alaikum. Am I saying it right? Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. And then you say malaikum Because <laughs> no. every time Zayn answers the phone, your dad's calling. Mm -hmm. He's like salam alaikum. And for the longest time, and I knew that meant like peace on to you. And then I always thought like it needed like another. You know, well then also on to you. Well, that was it. It was. And then I was watching a movie one time, and they were like salam alaikum, malaikum assalam. <laughs> And it was like, uh -huh. bada bing, bada boom. What if I was home when you tried to bring Matt in? I thought you were. It was kind of like a last minute. Oh, okay. I was just like, ooh, let's do this. And I do remember telling you that Matt was coming in a day early, but I don't know if you heard me or not. You said that he was coming Thursday. But you're like, oh, I'm not really sure. And you kept saying, I don't know. Yeah, I forgot what day was Thursday. It's just so fun to scare you. It doesn't matter. Even if he knew Matt was with me, you still would have reacted the same I way. I would have because he came from my closet. <laughs> I probably gave you like PTSD. Every time Wait. you walk into your closet. Oh, I already have that fear. Especially when you're in town. Or like, I'm home alone. I'm like, Zane's somewhere in this house. If you're scared of me, you haven't met David yet. I Assalamu alaikum. We'll make him a song. Need that butter. No, oh, People are gonna be commenting that it's not know what he's doing. <laughs> they were gonna be so angry saying this isn't a mood bang. It isn't though. Guys, portion control. We're not gonna have a bunch of food out here when we're not gonna eat at all. We would though. What are your other favorite Indian dishes? Is this Indian? They all look the same, but it's just different colors. <laughs> My second favorite is nahari. nahari. It's more of a beef curry. It's like dark brown. It's in there, so bad. But it's so good. It's like it's a so different bad. type of. I ate at a place in London that was amazing. It was an Indian restaurant. Most Indian restaurants I go to, it's so bad. They just don't know how to cook it. This one was nice. Modern and young. I like, oh, rarely really? see Indian restaurants. Oh, before. it was like a trendy spot in LA. How's the show go? Is it like when it's, it's New like, York it's like and a, Boston shows? Yeah, exactly that. Because I got a little taste of it at Playlist. You did great. I'm I was so surprised. I was so surprised. So I that would never. Did you block out as soon as you walked out? I don't even remember what I said. I'm watching videos of people who recorded it. I'm just like, I said that. Remember when I thought you cursed on stage? Oh, yeah. What do you think she said? I called you a hassle.
asshole. Why? Why? Yeah. Yeah. He goes, what's it like? Being Zayn's sister. Being Zayn's sister. Like, it's a hassle. And I was like, Why would I say hassle? Oh, no, that's such like a that. weird word. But that's just, I didn't know that. The Jazz family were all, always saying words that don't make like, sense. And I was like, Oh my gosh, it dies like first time. I don't know how people eat and talk because I can't. I can't either. Especially when the food's really good. What's the new Kiki dance? It's like trending on Instagram right now. Yeah, Kiki, do you love me? You know more rap songs than I do. Oh, yeah, I listen to a lot of rap songs. You, you know, know the words, you know like all words too. Zayn listens to a lot of country songs. Oh, everything, he, not, no, 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 country, no, no, not country, not very like basic, like white girl. Yeah. Oh, what? what? I'm sorry. Give me examples, because I'm well, pretty we, offended we right like, now. Show me your playlist, because we were in the car and he was putting songs, I'm like, what is this? Well, Zayn, this? we do like, kind of like poppy white girl music. It, it, it's, it's fun, fun. it is it's fun. fun. Sorry that, you know, you can't dance, because it's a sin in your religion. You know why? Your dad's at the World Cup? Yeah. That's awesome. That's what we used to uh, work. Have you been to the World Cup? No, but I worked at the Olympics in London. Dude, yeah. that was so much fun. That was the most fun I've ever had. Don't take me. I know, I'm like jealous of like all your like your magnets on your refrigerator. He's like one from China, Hold on. one from- <laughs> no. There's no mag- there's one, like four magnets up there. You know Bob won't let me work with him? I wouldn't either. Better work ethic. You would not be able to- I have an amazing work ethic. Uh-uh. You'd let buses go without anybody in there. I literally get up at 6 in the morning so I can be at school at 6 30. My school starts at 7. We all had to get up at 6 my in the morning. My school started at 7 40, Zane. That's not my fault. Why would you be there an hour early? Because I was selling coffee and croissants to the children that were coming off the bus. So you, so you have to do that? No, that was a choice, Zane. I was coffee shop manager. You said coffee shop manager? Do you like my new shirt that I bought the other day? I do like it. Very touristy. Yeah, I went to 7 I, I, and I was like, I gotta have that shirt. It literally just has boats on it, so it's for large. I like wearing, like, when I was in DC for playlists, I wore, like, a tacky DC touristy sweater. Well, I need to undo his clothes. With the Boston one, I wore a Harvard sweater. Hey, Di, hey, Di wears, like, tourist clothes. You mean terrorist clothes. <laughs> <laughs> my favorite one was the Friday, Saturday, and Sunday or Monday one. I was like, where is that? Like, it was missing a day. No, it wasn't. Yeah, it was. It was. It meant, you bought me a shirt that was illiterate. Oh, but it was such like a limited two shirt. A so limited two. I'm gonna delete that. Why not? I don't believe. I'm sorry. I'm just kidding. You clean up late. Well, I'm yeah. like, mine is like. Are you calling her fat? No. no. What? Um, okay. I think you touched this one, so you might want to take that. <laughs> Let me reach our He made me take the first break without showing him. Hey Matt, how about some henna before you go? <gasps> really? My mom does henna. Don't you have henna? Am I, am I she does henna. Oh you my do? god. I, I, I used to do henna when I was like. Well, my in cousin got like a transformer one on his shoulder. He had an allergic reaction and puffed up. Oh, no. Where should I get it? You, should, you shouldn't get it on your hand. Can I get it? No, I can't. <laughs> If you got a tattoo, I feel like you should get it and henna first so you see if you yeah. actually want that. Because oh, that's gonna go away in a week. So but henna is so blotchy. It's like it doesn't stay Not like Not necessarily. Like you do it before it's coming off, it does become blotchy. So at that time you just scrub it, it comes off completely. Love the smell. What is it? It's like a mud, right? Huh? No, it's leaves. That just makes leaves? no sense. It's leaves with eucalyptus oil and maybe tea and chemicals. I don't know, sometimes it smells like poop. Stop. How are you guys still? Baby, like, I have a big appetite. We're gonna count how many times I've booked a little ding like <laughs> Hell down on his paper. How many times Zane reach for the yeah, it's, it's really you hard to like be full off this because it's so good. I'm stuck, dude. You need to finish your food. Matt, I'm you stuck too, but I'm not going to stop. Is well, isn't it always you keep a little on your plate so they know you're done? If it's empty, they're just going to keep serving you? My dad's not here. Don't worry about that. You want to hear a story about when I passed out at school? Sure. When I was in third grade, I was like, oh. I was kind of... Okay, sorry. This talks about a lot of repeats. Really. I was kind of like the jokester of the class. I would stand during my lunch and just like make jokes. Okay. I was taking a test that I had to make up. I remember. No, stop. Oh. <laughs> I got to the best part. I was jokester. Jo okay. okay. I was retaking my math test and my heart started hurting and I fell off my chair and I passed out. And my teacher was literally like, "Can I get up? You're not funny." And I'm like. <laughs> From telling too many jokes? From taking a test, my heart got oh, really like, and what did that have to do with you telling jokes again? Well, she was because that's why my teacher said, no. Can I, and that's not funny. Got and, it. and I'm literally on the floor, my hands, like, they curled, and my eyes went to the back of my head, and my lips turned blue. And apparently I was staring at this boy, and this boy started crying. And when I woke up, I see him in the corner crying. How long were you fainted for? <laughs> oh my god! He didn't believe me for, like, a good 30 seconds. No, I remember when I first learned long division. Good multiplication. I, you know I, I don't know what time But I never really learned how to long divide. I don't know how to divide it. Give like, me anything I can divide. That's probably why I fail so many times in my math. You gotta understand it. It's the one subject where you're guaranteed like a hundred if you just know how to do it. There's an answer. It's not like no. English where no multiple choice in math. Things are a little bit more math. ambiguous on how you write. If you know how to solve a math problem, there's an end to it. What's most of the time is you have to explain when you like show your.
you're wearing and it makes shooting like, so hard. I would understand the problem, but I'm just not good at like setting it up. So I would just not get the question right because I knew the answer, I knew how to do it, but I wasn't able to show it right. So you were yeah. cheating. Oh, yeah. He, he got an A in his math. I was the really good. Was not even teaching. He was a very good. He learned on his own. Get it, Zane. The teacher was giving him a hard time. You I'm really? your child. What's the Pythagorean theorem? What was that? That was God telling you, let's not talk about math. What's the fact that you're in the room? Religion, politics, and math. Nah. Not allowed. Not allowed. Oh, that was on the list of 10 things to know. Don't talk about politics. Oh, no, 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 you can't. It just because my father's not there. No, no, you can't talk about it with Lala. You'll never win. I think the worst is when people put on their views on other people intensely. Everybody has their own views, but I hear people out. I go, I hear you, I see you. Exactly. Yeah, yeah I'm so full. Oh, I'm making crepes. Don't get full. You're making crepes? We stay for tea and coffee. Yes. Oh, you'll never leave we'll my house at we'll like midnight. We'll I'll we'll let you leave. We'll have Arabic tea and we like to talk. We like to talk shit. Oh, we oh, talk at this table for hours. We spill all the tea. We're all done here. They're this playing their plate and then my <laughs> guys for food is just like chicken tikka. <laughs> we're talking about when you graduate, the scholarship you're going to get is the chicken tikka. Gosh. Chicken tikka. Chicken tikka. Chicken tikka. Chicken tikka. Creative essay on making chicken tikka masala. I make model write it for me. <laughs> Thank you for watching. I hope you learned a lot. You misses a Jazzy for making this. <laughs> <laughs> Search oh, the B. Yeah. yeah. Bakura. Bakura. It's not Bakura. <laughs> Bakura. It's Batul. 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 My bad, this Batul. <laughs> You're Lebanese. Half American, half Lebanese. Dude, did I tell you I met this Lebanese girl like, at Bungalow? Was she wearing a scarf? No. Then she's not. She's not good. I had nothing in common. Oh yeah. yeah. She likes halal food. You like her? Food. After this, I like halal food. <laughs> halal, we're like halal <laughs> Muslim, Muslim, let me ask you a question. <laughs> Alright guys, thanks for watching. Make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more stuff from me and all my friends. Shout out to so Courtney, thank you so much for keeping up with all my stuff and watching all my videos. I really appreciate it. Baby, let's end this video with a nice little wrap. Alright, all right, ready? Hey! Hey! Oh! Oh! Oh my god, oh. baby! <laughs>